end of turn nine on Twilight Struggle. Uh, let me swing through what's happened. Uh, victory point wise, about where we were before. I think the Russians gained a little bit of space there. Uh, the European situation, which has remained stable. I mean, there's been a lot of attempts to fight there, but uh, it's really tough to push the, the U.S. out. Um, they can basically react wherever they like. Let's look at the cards and what their possible effects were. Uh, we had a terrorism uh, event played by the U.S., which uh, I don't remember what that got rid of. And then uh, eh, I'm losing my place. And then the Soviets played the Iranian hostage crisis, which got them into Iran when then they got booted out <laughs> by was it a coup? Yeah, there was a coup in Iran. Um, okay. Uh, other than that, the uh, Russians fired off a Southeast Asia victory point card. Um, they figured they weren't going to be able to put enough effort into there to make up for, uh, you know, to gain any additional points. They had a lot of good points already in there. They still do. Uh, they actually did expand, but not in Southeast Asia. Well, they picked up Thailand, which they didn't have, which would have been worth a lot, but I don't think they could have counted on it. Um, uh, so what do we have here? We have the kitchen debates. Uh, the U.S. was able to pull that off and get the points for that. Russians fired off the socialist governments. Uh, that was one of their attempts to gain or to dislodge the U.S. Uh, in France and Italy. It got turned back. Um, U.S. fired off uh, the arms treaty. Just that's overall a nice card for whoever gets it. Uh, the brush war was in Italy. It failed. I played Shea because he seems like such an advantage card rather than try to use his few points over in Europe. Uh, he failed on the first attempt. The U.S. decided to throw off the Formosan resolution just in order to put a little bit more pressure on the Soviets. If the U.S. can't get the automatic victory out, they can probably get the victory points elsewhere. South, uh, Asia is one of the places. And then the Russians played Solidarity, um, just because Poland really, you know, it's one of many countries that are lost already, so why, uh, why fight harder for it? Um, pretty much position-wise, things have stayed the same. Let me just sweep through the board. Not a lot has changed. Uh, a little bit more Russian influence over in the Asian area. And that's about it. Uh, we got one more turn. If the Russians can't do something about Europe, they lose an auto victory. Uh, so it looks pretty bad for them given that they don't have the victory point advantage. Of course, they still are winning the space race. Uh, it isn't really doing them too much good. Being able to discard a card is nice. Oh, sorry about the shaking. Um, my poor hand. And All right. And... Uh, I should have a, a wrap-up after this.